What's happening, my curious bunch of health fanatics? As we age, millions of cells become dormant and linger in their tissues amongst their healthy cells. These dormant cells are known as senescent cells and can cause a myriad of trouble for us. Instead of dying through programmed cell death, which is known as apoptosis, these senescent cells can begin sending out signals to the surrounding cells and tissues, which cause problems such as inflammation and even disease. When the number of senescent cells becomes ubiquitous amongst our tissues, it affects many other cells adversely and speeds up the effects of aging and also the propensity for disease. Luckily for us all, scientists have developed weapons known as senolytic drugs to clear out our bodies of these cells to ensure our tissues get rid of these troublemaking cells. There are many moving parts inside a cell and just like any system with moving parts, if those parts do not work flawlessly, then incorrect function can creep in. A well-known senolytic compound that has shown great promise is fisetin, which is, a, which is found in fruits and vegetables. This compound was discovered in a study conducted by the University of Minnesota. Fisetin also inhibits an inflammatory response in human osteoarthritis by activating the CERT1 gene, which some scientists argue is a primary longevity gene. A study published in Advances in Experimental Medicine and Technology in 2016 says, Fisetin is a dietary flavonoid found in various fruits, such as strawberries, apples, mangoes, persimmons, kiwis and grapes and some vegetables such as tomatoes, onions and cucumbers and also nuts and wine and has shown strong anti-inflammatory, antioxidant, anti-tumorigenic, anti-invasive, anti-angiogenic, anti-diabetic, neuroprotective, cardioprotective effects in cell culture and in animal models relevant to human diseases." End quote. The fact that fisetin is already a senolytic but also has so many other benefits such as those listed already means that fisetin would be hard to leave out of your anti-aging regime. Quercetin is another plant-based compound found in onions, green tea, apples and berries and worth using. Like it or not, the evidence to eat plants over animal products continues to come in and is quite compelling. I am yet to read any peer-reviewed study where it was better to consume dairy or meat products over plants. An inconvenient truth for some meat lovers, I know, but I simply go where the scientific evidence leads me. And so far, the evidence overwhelmingly is in favor of a plant-based diet. Another senolytic compound, but this time pharmaceutical and much more powerful, is known as darsatinib. This drug is used to clear cancer cells and should only be used with extreme caution and under the watchful eye of a professional medical practitioner that understands how this drug works. So always chat with your doctor about health data you see online. I am a long-term user of senolytics, but other ways to purge these zombie-like cells also exists. Both autophagy and fasting can both purge senescent cells independently as well. I'll link to a video on autophagy at the end of this one. Senescent cells are a major cause of premature aging and disease. Clearing out your bodily tissues of disease-causing senescent cells is one of the most powerful anti-aging pathways you can harness as it lessens your body's chance of premature aging and disease. Basically, Purging zombie cells makes you more disease resistant. Pound that thumbs up button, smash the subscribe button, or face the consequences of your actions. Check out my online video course if you wanna learn a ton more about biohacking, resisting the aging process, becoming healthier, and most importantly, disease resistant www.scienceofaging.life and I will list a discount code for you in the details below. As always, stay young and stay vibrant.